One of the biggest problems for the Los Angeles Lakers this season has been their backup point guard position. Rondo has been pretty terrible after a good start, as he's been turnover prone and surprisingly poor decision maker given his reputation. The Lakers could use a consistent backup point guard option who can both score and distribute, and also is a good pick and roll partner for the Lakers bigs. Guys like D. Rose has been mentioned in trade rumors, but it may be costly to trade for him given how well he's been playing for the Pistons. One cheap and forgotten option for the Lakers is Jeremy Lin, who is currently playing for the Beijing Ducks in China. Lin has been one of the best players in China so far this season, and he played last season for the Hawks and the Raptors. While he definitely struggled with Toronto due to a poor fit, he showed that he can still be one of the best backup point guards in the NBA with the Hawks. So, let's go over how Jeremy Lin would fit with the Lakers, and why exactly he would be a great fit in a return to LA. And before we get into it, if you want to see more interesting NBA content just like this, be sure to drop a like and subscribe as I really do appreciate all of your guys' support. So first, Lin would likely be able to sign with LA around March or April, once the CBA season ends. Lin's team is almost guaranteed to make the playoffs, but if they do get ousted early, Jeremy will be able to sign with an NBA team before the NBA playoffs start. Lin would provide the Lakers with a great backup point guard option, and he would provide some quick scoring off the bench. Last season, Lin was coming off a torn patellar tendon tear, and he still looked pretty good in his first year back. With the Hawks, he averaged 10.7 points, 3.5 assists, and 2.3 rebounds in only 19.7 minutes per game. He was great at attacking the rim to break down the fences, and he has the court vision to find shooters out at the perimeter as well. But he can also finish at the rim with high accuracy, and he's excellent at drawing fouls. He's a smart player who is crafty in the paint, and while he's not as quick as he once was due to injury, he is still definitely quick enough to blow by most defenders with ease. I think the biggest thing Lin would bring to the Lakers would be an excellent pick and roll point guard who can deliver the ball to the big man on target. The Lakers have so many great pick and roll bigs with Davis, McGee, and Howard, but it seems that they are being underutilized given the Lakers' lack of consistent playmaking point guards. Lin has been known to be one of the best pick and roll players in the NBA since he broke out on the scene, and he's consistently been able to dissect the fences in the pick and roll and either hit the roll man or get the easy basket for himself. He's also a very good mid-range shooter and a decent three-point shooter for his career, and he shouldn't be much of a negative or a positive in terms of floor spacing. Don't forget, Jeremy has experience playing with Howard back when they were on the Rockets together, and those two off the bench will be an amazing pick and roll combo to have that would destroy opposing second units. In addition, Lin has good size for a point guard at 6'3", and he's an underrated defender. He's very good in ISO situations and as a team defender, and this has been one aspect of his game that he's really developed since his Lin Sanity days. Overall, I would love to see Jeremy Lin return to the NBA and get a chance to be the backup point guard for the Lakers. Rondo just is not cutting it right now, and signing Lin to a non-guaranteed deal to see if he works out will be a low-risk, high-reward signing. He still can definitely play at the NBA level, and his dominance in China as well as his great backup point guard play last season with the Hawks proves just that. He was still recovering from a significant injury in his first season back last year, and I think he'll look much better this NBA season. We'll see what happens, and if the Lakers cannot get a good backup point guard for cheap in the trade or buyout market, signing Jeremy may be a great move to help spark their second unit offense. So that's a wrap, thank you all for watching, if you guys did enjoy this video and want to see more daily NBA content just like this, be sure to drop a like and subscribe and also be sure to turn on post notifications so you can stay updated when my newest video will be coming out. Also be sure to follow me on Instagram and hit me up if you want to talk about basketball or business, just drop a comment down below on my photo or DM me and I'll definitely try to get back to most of you guys there as well. Drop a comment down below on who you want to see the Lakers sign as a backup point guard option. Do you want to see Jeremy Lin or someone else? Let me know down in the comments below. As I do it all comments, I'm definitely interested to see what you guys have to say there. So, with all that being said, once again, thank you all for watching and hopefully, I will see you guys soon for the next video. Peace.